on the other side? Yeah, a centimeter. Okay. Okay. So here's some information I want you to write down. Okay? Write this down. One centimeter equals ten millimeters. Okay? What that means is that there are ten little bitty, um, uh, what am I trying to say? Units in every one centimeter. Okay? So everybody look at yours. And as you can see, it says centimeter. So within this zero to one, everybody look at this side, the centimeter side. From zero to one, there are ten I'm ticks. Just going to go. It looks upside down on both sides. Oh, there you go. Oh. What is okay. between a millimeter? So from zero to one, there are ten ticks, right? That's millimeter. What is it between yes. a millimeter? Yes. So every you see one little tick, that's one millimeter. Okay, in between the zero and the one centimeters. Everybody understand? So there are 10 of those millimeters in between the centimeter. Everybody understand what I'm saying? Okay, good stuff. Now, they tell me that the distance across a nickel is about two centimeters. So right here, okay, from here to here. And they want to know how many millimeters is that? That's 20. 20, very good. Now, how did you do that? Because I just did 10 plus 10. Yes. We know that there are 10 millimeters from 0 to 1, and we know there's 10 millimeters from 1 to 2. So there's 10, 20. 20 millimeters from 0 to 2. Everybody understand that? Okay. Another way to look at that is to go, okay, this is 2 centimeters, so that would be 20 millimeters, just by looking at the conversion. You see how I did that on the board? Okay. Yes. It's like um, when you're counting by 10s, if you just do 1 times 10, it equals 10, and yes. then 2 times 10 equals Yes, 20. yes, yes. Very good. You're exactly right. Okay. Everybody look at example 2 on page 218. All right. And they want to know what is the length of the rectangle below, and it's in millimeters. Oh. oh yes. Is it, um... Right here. Right here? That one up there. And these are in millimeters, like 10, yes. 20, 30, 40. Okay. Is it... 20 millimeters and a half. Close. 22, 22. Okay, here's what I want y'all to do. Where did my thing go? Okay. What page are we on? 20. Oh, it says 25 millimeters. Yes, it is 22. 25. So here's what I want you to see. It's from here, zero. Okay, here was 20. And I want y'all to count your small ticks after 20. So look at your book and start counting from 20. Every tick, say 21. The next tick, 22. The next tick, 23. Right here. How long is this? It is 25. So everybody see that? It's 25, isn't it? Okay? So, um, the way that I can know that is because it was from 20 and here was 30 right here. So I know that it's going to be 20 something from 20 to all the way to here, okay? Because I have not reached 30 yet, so it's going to be either 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. It's going to be one of those numbers. We have to figure out which one, okay? And that's by counting the ticks. Got it? Everybody understand? Okay. Now, um, in this world, uh, everybody else, China, Europe, wherever, uses the metric system. Which is, oh, this is centimeters, millimeters, kilometers, um, kilograms, milligrams, just the kilomilla, all those the things that you see on this. Guess what the United States uses? Inches. Inches. Feet, miles, um, just totally different measurements than you what everybody else uses. Something else was different too, the only way the United States. Yes, degrees. Yeah. Yep. So, isn't that strange that for some reason the United States uses a totally they different system? So, you're more apt to hear feet, inches, miles than you are millimeters, kilometers, and those things like that. I hear kilometers okay. and millimeters. When Sometimes, yeah, you're right. I hear them a lot. Especially because you're in math and you're doing this now. Okay? Now, so everybody turn to the inches side. Okay. Okay, so it'll just flip it. All right. How long is that arrow? Okay, you can actually probably use that, the one that's in your book. They actually have a ruler system right there. How many inches is the arrow? Yes. Wait, what arrow? The arrow on page 219. Oh. Wait, is that? Yes. There isn't an arrow. Oh, that. How long?
long is it? It's, Tell me. Oh, it's two and um. It's thirty millimeters. No. It's not. Where are you looking at, buddy? Two inches. No, nope, this one. Um, oh my goodness, I'm not. It's two inches and a half. Two and, a half two and a half inches. Okay, so what do I want y'all to notice? Does anybody remember what the most important thing to remember when you're looking at scales? Four, yes. Two and five ninths. T tenths, actually. Tens. Yeah. Okay. What was the main thing I told you to always remember? That to count the ticks. How many ticks are between two and three, or one and two, or zero to one? Ten. So there are ten jumps. So there's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, and then ten all the way to goes to three. Okay? And they put it on one, two, three, four, five. They put it on this one, right? Okay? Which will be two and five tenths. And y'all remember how we reduced five tenths? Have I taught y'all that yet? No. 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 <laughs> okay. So y'all know that five is half of ten, right? So we know that it's half. Two and ten tenths? Is that you? Could no, you you'll, you'll actually learn how to reduce so you later. You have on. to say five tenths instead of a half. No, you're you're supposed to say two and a half because okay. five is half of ten, okay. which is actually one half. You'll learn how to do this later. Okay, you can actually see that it's two and a half right now, right? Yeah. Okay, but what if? Okay. Oh, I think it's like what dividing if I, and multiplying. Is that how you reduce? What'd you, you say, Dora? You do, you do. Very good. You'll actually learn how to do that later. But good job. Okay, last question. They want to know, is two and three-fourths inches closer to two inches or closer to three inches? What you think? Two. Closer to two? Two. Two? Uh, three. Three? Okay, two and three-fourths closer to two inches or three? Alright, oh, I'm going to draw three. it. Ha, ha, ha. How many ticks does it have? Four. 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 So watch this. Three. Oh, yeah. Okay, so this is one jump, two jumps, three jumps. Started closer. Out of the four, so is it closer to three or closer to two? Closer to three. Very good. Good job. Okay, it's, it's a lot easier to see once you draw it, ain't it? Well, I was there.